Hello, welcome to Bark Louder. Thanks for your visit today. We're always here for your pet information needs. Did you know that out of 100,000 German shepherds, 2053 were affected by panosteitis? Panosteitis is a painful inflammation of the outer surface or shaft of one or more long bones of the legs in dogs. It is sometimes called growing pains. Panosteitis may occur in more than one bone at a time or may move around, causing a shifting lameness that goes from one bone or leg to another. Young, rapidly growing dogs are more prone to this problem. For example, German Shepherd, Most Common, Great Dane, Golden Retriever, Labrador Retriever, Rottweiler, Doberman Pinscher, and Basset Hound. Affected dogs are usually between 6 and 18 months of age. The underlying cause of panosteitis is unknown, but genetics, stress, infection, metabolism, or nutrition may be factors. The typical symptom is a sudden, unexplained, painful lameness of one or more legs. The lameness may be mild or severe. The most common bone affected is the humerus, upper arm, but panosteitis may also be found in the radius and ulna, both bones in the foreleg, the femur, thigh, and or the tibia, lower rear leg. The affected bone will be painful to the touch. You may also notice other symptoms, such as fever, not eating, tiredness, or weight loss. If you suspect your dog has panosteitis, it's important to take them to a veterinarian for an accurate diagnosis. Your veterinarian will suspect panosteitis if the dog shows pain when pressure is applied to the affected bones. The diagnosis is confirmed by x-rays, radiographs, which usually show a characteristic increase in the density of the affected bones. I hope this information helps you understand panosteitis better. Subscribe to our channel for more pet information videos.